is welcome to my video my name is Sanjeev I am from India and this channel will contain videos which kind of uh, where I log about my journey you know about learning about web development and specifically about you know I'm enrolled in this course here called David Connolly Speed Coding Academy and I can't tell you how excited I am that I've been able to you know join this course now uh, a little bit about me like I've been wanting to learn web development for about a couple of years now so apart from my day job I would spend about at least an hour or more every day after work searching the internet looking for you know courses free courses uh, web development books and you know checking out YouTube for some way where I could learn the entire art you know the entire uh, the whole uh, knowledge which is required to become a web developer all I wanted to do all I want to do is to become a freelance web developer and start you know getting some work from one of these freelancer sites like Upwork and freelancer.com there are many of them you know I, I would go to those sites and I would see you know these freelancers with amazing profiles bidding on jobs and you know I would I would think what uh, what is required to become you know like one of these freelancers what do I need to do so I have spent hundreds of dollars on sites like you know lynda.com and plural site and I can tell you guys this is a very very bad idea this, uh, this is not the right way to go about doing it I've spent so much of time it's not that I don't know I you know I've, I've been on these sites I know uh, CSS and bit of PHP and JavaScript but thing is uh, none of these places really tell me you know how to become a uh, a full stack as they call it a complete A to Z web developer there is no course here or on plural site you know or many of these sites which tell me hey you want to be a freelancer freelance web developer and you want to know everything right from putting a website together uh, to you know hosting it on a um, on a web host a Linux web host and how to do the back-end work and how to secure your site you know there is not I've been like like I told you I spent about a whole year subscription here more than three hundred dollars on right now this is linkedin.com but it was previously lynda.com I spent a lot of money here I've spent money on plural site this cost pretty expensive um, um, subscription it's about forty dollars per month at least if I'm not wrong and I also purchased books from Amazon uh, I've purchased courses on Udemy but none of them told me you know like I will tell you how to go from a person who doesn't know anything about web development to a full-fledged practical web developer which can you know so that you can start taking jobs on freelancer sites or at least become ready for getting a job on a, you know on all these job market online so I'm sorry if I'm rambling guys but this is just a unedited raw video I'm just trying to log my you know my journey and this is my first video so here I'm trying to tell you how I landed up here in David Connolly's Speed Coding Academy which was sheer luck and I think providence because I think God saw me you know moving from all these free YouTube videos and all of these places and then he said okay let's finally get you to a place where you know your journey can really begin now how I landed upon David Connolly's site and this course was that I was actually going through a you know a blog of a web developer who does freelancing work on Upwork and I, w I liked his videos because he seemed like a very honest person and he was telling his experiences with his clients you know his like his first freelancing job and then his second freelancing job I forget his name I think it is Michael something and if I'm not wrong and uh, I used to really enjoy watching his videos he was giving me behind the scenes look of what it is like to you know actually take on the web development work 
and and he mentioned happened to mention David Connolly and he said look guys i don't know anything compared to this guy he is a real deal and because i respected this person so much i immediately jumped i searched for david connolly and then i started watching his videos now guys one thing which i really liked about his channel now let me bring up david's channel here now this guy he is a very honest and authentic kind of person that is my feel uh, which i got from watching his videos and you know what uh, even though i'm not a professional web developer i've dabbled enough in you know in web development to know that many of the places wherever i've gone uh, i find the whole web development thing a very complex and very involved uh, process he is the only person who i found telling me that you know it doesn't have to be so complicated most of what you're seeing online is you know uh, is to be frank it's just a um, what do i say it's a money making scam job you know so that you will never find you know if you go to these i see i'm not knocking sites like linkedin.com and plural site now these are very well made courses and very professionally done and by professionals i don't really know about the background of the people you know who are making these courses but i'm sure they must definitely be having some web development experience but the thing is they they go on and on and on i'll come to that in a minute why these sites are such a bad idea but the thing is with david he is very honest and another thing is you know he doesn't present just one face in his channels you know he's like he shows his complete side the good side the you know the bad side i mean the warts and all he's he's all out there like he tells about his problems also his shortcomings and so uh, i mean it's definitely if you if you're coming from david's channel out here then i i don't think you need me to tell you about david connolly but if you happen to chance upon this video from by searching on youtube then definitely you should uh, watch david's uh, video the amazing i mean i'm just the channel alone is uh, you know will teach you a lot what he has to say and speed coding like nobody is talking about this now why this is interesting to me is that before i want i was actually at once upon a time a freelance animator i was a character animator and i used to do freelance work for clients so you know if you don't deliver on time it's it does it's not enough to just know how to you know do animation i'm telling from this from a character animation point of view like first of all learning character animation is such a difficult job there's so much of knowledge and after learning it you have to deliver to your clients on time if you're a freelancer and i've lost so many jobs when i could not deliver my work on time and the same thing applies to web development I mean if you don't deliver your work on time your clients are going to be pissed off and they're not coming back and you will like make less money because your then your frequency of jobs you take on per month is less you know stuff like that so this is an amazing concept and you know I don't think anyone is teaching this anywhere this is entirely David's uh brainwave so he's a person you know he, no, so let me tell you why speed coding academy is so great uh, david connelly is a web developer who's been who has created about 1000 websites over a period of 20 years both front end and back end complete php based websites and he does javascript stuff too and uh, uh so a person with 20 years of experience in web development it has a website which is going to teach me everything i need to know from a to z about web development guys i don't know any place on the internet like i told you for 2 years i spent every day after work searching for exactly this exactly this someone which will take me from html to you know till the entire thing deploying security and email is such a big deal i can tell you that you know and frameworks and you know the whole thing a to z 
I don't think there is any person online who's a working web developer who's willing to teach you this. I wouldn't, if I was a web developer who was with 20 years of experience, I will not give out my skills for the amount David gives out, $450, it's nothing. I would, I just wouldn't do it. So I consider myself very lucky. And this is just one of the things he's giving out. He's, he also has uh, some amazing uh, software which is coming along, which will help me speed up my workflow. And there is a great framework in the works. So I'm so excited about this whole journey. And so yeah, one more thing I want to tell you is that, you know, this. let's talk about this module, the first one, the HTML module, all right? So like I said, I have been to these sites like uh, lynda.com and actually I've taken this exact course which, I'm, which I have here to show you HTML essential training. Now this is a almost a six hour course as you can see here, duration six hours. Six hours of knowledge to learn HTML, can you beat that? And here, this inside this module, David covers the entire thing in under one and a half hours. I totaled up the duration of the video that's under 90 minutes. So in under 90 minutes, I get to know from a guy who has spent 20 years creating about a thousand websites, just the right amount of HTML to use, which he uses on a daily basis. Can you beat that? I couldn't find that anywhere, you know. And then the same thing with CSS. Now in CSS, it's amazing. We he takes it to the next level with stuff like drills. I'll I'll post a video and you know, but I'll give you a small snippet of uh, how he does it. Just the audio snippet. I'll give you an audio of him, you know, taking us through the speed drill. It's amazing. I showed it to my wife and it just blew her mind. And you know, because she had a doubt, you know, you're just jumping into this course. You don't even know this guy. Uh, I totally have. I'm, you know, I am a person who goes by instincts. I've made a lot of mistakes and I've spent hundreds of dollars in sites like this. And I can tell you that I don't think uh, I've made a mistake here. I know I'm on the right track. And uh, yeah. So, you know, all these sites like lynda.com and plural site, they have this, you know, this is how they do it. It's a take the guesswork out of learning. It can be tough to know where to start learning. Parts, com parts, okay, these are the learning parts. I'll come to that. Combine specific courses and tools into one experience to teach you any given skill from start to finish. Wow, this seems like I'll have to eat my words, right? Learn any given skill from start to finish. Parts are aligned to an individual's knowledge level. Okay, so let's walk down this path. I want to learn how to do web development. Where do I, is there any web development path here guys? AngularJS, sorry, it's way out of my, you know. So I don't know any of this and I'm still searching for web development path. So this is at the beginning of my journey. Just imagine if I land out here and I'm just trying to figure out how to learn web development from this huge list out here, all right? So, okay, there is one for HTML5, 14 courses, 45 hours, and this is just HTML5. Wow, thank you so much. Now, let me give you a sneak peek into David's HTML module. Now, this is really not allowed. Actually, it's a violation because just to enter this page out here, which you're seeing, I've paid $450 and you're getting to see this for free. So this is the last lesson guys, lesson number 12. I'm not going to take you to the lesson, but you know this video here is so one single video, just one video covering HTML5, just one video, all right? And let's contrast that to LinkedIn Learning, which has 74 courses on HTML5, 74 courses just covering HTML5. And Plural site has 14 courses of 45 hours covering just HTML5. And in contrast, what do we get here? A word about HTML5. Guys, let me tell you this. Just this video alone is worth the price of entry. What do I mean by that? You know, 
how much time do you have and how much life do you have you know how much can you retain now these guys are giving you the entire supermarket or the entire menu now it's like going to a hotel and eating the entire chinese course whatever they have you know oh my god i mean and here david is telling me what html5 he has used and he uses daily when you know when he builds websites you know after having built 1000 websites and he's telling me guys this is what you need to know most of the time when you using html5 contrast that with this huh 74 courses and what do we have here 14 courses how am i supposed to figure out what is required and this is just html5 mind you and uh, let's go on jquery 8 courses wow javascript 9 courses 28 hours goes on like that so this is what these people do see i'm not saying the information they're giving out is bad mysql 8 courses 17 hours wow so this is the whole problem with these sites guys the course material is excellent i'm not knocking the courses i'm not knocking these sites i told you like i myself have spent a lot of time and hours here on the sites like these and uh, the thing is it's like an ocean you know you will drown into one of these topics and you will kind of die there you'll never come out of it i'm telling you because none of them are telling me just what I need to know to be up and running. So guys, this is my first video and uh, I'm so excited that I have started on this journey. So if you're like me and you want to be a full, uh, I don't know, I don't want to use the word full stack. You want to be a proper a professional web developer. And right here, the target is not just to be a web developer. I think the idea is to be one of the top developers in the world and one of the fastest developers in the world. So learning web development, just the right amount is just one of the goals which is achieved here. The second goal is to become one of the fastest developers. And then there are tools which uh, help us get in that, you know, which uh, to help us along. And just one more thing I want to tell about David, which is so mind blowing is that, you know, that uh, he has a feature here inside this training course where if I have a question, I can post it in that particular video and I can click a checkbox. Uh, and then when I post my question in that, uh, you know, for, for example, uh, let me put it this way. I've seen this HTML5 video and have some questions. So there is a uh, area below the video where I can post a comment or ask a question. And then I can put a checkbox which will, I can, I can tick a checkbox. And then when I click submit, David, wherever he is, gets a ping on his phone that somebody on the forum, on his site, on Speed Coding Academy has a question and he comes aboard and answers that question guys none of these places you will not get this here you know nobody is going to do it here and i don't know anyone you know even if you were to find a web developer of david's caliber which i really doubt to have him at your beck and call i think it's out of question nobody people charge you by the minute by the hour you know for their time for consultation this is free consultation from one of from one of the best developers in the world so why am i doing this you know i really had two minds about creating this video because you know it has taken me such a long time to hit upon this site and it was a bit of a providence bit of a luck that i you know chanced upon speed coding academy so I don't want to have too much of competition, too many people joining, but uh, I keep wondering there, might, there must be somebody like me who is, you know, who badly wants to change his future, who wants a career in web development and who has spent hours and years in frustration, hundreds of dollars and still roaming about. So if you're somebody like that, I think you should not think twice before joining David's course. 
And one final thing about this HTML module, which I want to mention is that, you know, HTML is such a boring subject. Like even he mentions that David says that, you know, before the module begins, like, I know this is a very boring thing, but we just have to go through it. I will cover only exactly what you need to know for, you know, practical work. But guys, when I was doing the course, when I was doing the videos, the way David speaks, it's like, you know, it's like having an instructor along with you right next to you that's the kind of feel you get it's like having a coach who's coaching you html it doesn't feel like an online instructor sitting somewhere telling you it feels like he's right here with me i can tell you guys i'm so excited about this journey and in the next video i'm going to post something about the css module and i'll give you that small snippet about how he does speed drills all right so stay tuned